Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm sharing with you how to make a chocolate lava cake. It's a warm chocolate cake with a gooey chocolate center which melts out like lava when you break it open. It's delicious and if you like chocolate it's the perfect dessert to make. So let's get started. To make these lava cakes more decadent, in this recipe I'm using melted chocolate. You can melt this in the microwave or over a double boiler like I am, whichever is easiest. Dark chocolate works best with this recipe as it's quite sweet, so the bitterness of the chocolate balances it out. Cut your chocolate up into smaller pieces and place it into a bowl. Fill a medium sized saucepan with a small amount of water and place it over high heat until it comes to the boil. Turn the heat off and place the bowl of chocolate over the saucepan. Stir the chocolate a few times and remove it from the heat once it's silky smooth and completely melted. Set the chocolate to the side to cool slightly while we prepare the remaining ingredients. If you would like the recipe for these chocolate lava cakes, it will be listed in the information box as well as on my website, so just click the link on the screen now. Next into a medium sized mixing bowl, we're going to add room temperature butter and white sugar. Make sure the butter is at room temperature as we're going to be creaming the ingredients together. Use a whisk to beat the butter and sugar together until well combined and a little lighter in colour. This should only take a couple of minutes. To the creamed butter and sugar, we're going to add three medium good quality free ranged eggs. Crack these eggs in one at a time, beating them well into the creamed butter and sugar before adding the next one. The batter should start to thin out and hold together well. Once the eggs are well incorporated, add a teaspoon of good quality vanilla extract. The vanilla pairs really well with the chocolate and helps to bring out some of its flavour. Lastly, before the melted chocolate, we need to add a small amount of regular white flour. The recipe only needs a small amount to help stabilise the cake so they don't fall apart while still allowing them to have a lava centre. Measure out the flour and add to the batter. You can sieve it here, but if you're using a whisk, you can just beat the batter to remove any lumps. Once the batter is smooth, we can pour in the melted chocolate. It should have cooled by now, you don't want it to be hot, but it shouldn't have set either. Whisk together until you have a smooth chocolate batter. The lava cakes are now ready to be baked, or it can be stored in the fridge for later, so it works well as a make ahead dessert. Divide the lava cake batter between the four ramekins. Make sure the ramekins have been greased and floured well, as these lava cakes love to stick. Place the ramekins into a 200 degree celsius or 400 degree fahrenheit oven for 14 minutes. Everyone's ovens are slightly different, so make sure to watch the cakes so the batter isn't overcooked. As soon as the lava cakes have finished baking, remove them from the oven and turn out onto plates straight away. If the ramekins were greased well, the cake should just slide right out. Sprinkle with some icing sugar and serve with some vanilla ice cream. Once you break the cake open, the lava center should melt out. Make sure you give these lava cakes a try and let me know what you think. Take a look at my channel for some more recipes. Thank you for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye!